Hello students, welcome back to Capman Academy and today we are going to talk about food packaging material plastic, right? And in the plastic we are also going to talk about its types. Hello students, welcome back to Capman Academy and today we are going to talk about one of the food packaging material which is plastic. Right, so as we all know, plastic has some very important property like water resistant, right, it is highly malleable, it has low cost, right, and basically it is synthesized, it is synthesized by polymerization process by the polymerization of monomer units monomer units right so plastic is basically of various types which is used in the food industry for the packaging purposes and first type of the plastic is known as polyolefins Second type of the plastic is your polyesters. Third type is known as polyvinyl, polyvinyl chloride. Fourth type of the plastic packaging material is polyvinylidene, polyvinylidene. chloride fifth type of the plastic packaging material is polystyrene sixth one is your polyamide seventh one is known as ethylene vinyl Alcohol, alcohol, also known as EVOH. Same way, polyvinyl chloride is also known as PVC. Right? So, these are the most common type of the plastics from which polyolefins are also categorized into different categories. First category is known as polyethylene which is also known as in short form PE and second category is polypropylene which is known as PP right same way polyesters here they are categorized into different categories first is polyethylene polyethylene Terephthalate, terephthalate, also known as PET. Right? Second category of the polyesters is your polycarbonate. Polycarbonate, also known as PC. Third category of the polyesters is known as polyethylene naphthalate polyethylene naphthalate this is also name as pen right so all these types are actually categorized according to the monomer units as i said to you that it is the polymerization of monomer units so you can see here in this case, first category, olefins are being polymerized. In case of polyesters, esters, monomer units are being used for the polymerization. In case of PVC, vinyl chloride is being used as the monomer unit. The same way, that is why all the names are comes under the category poly. So, poly means polymerization and the rest of the name means the monomer units which are being used for the 
plastic synthesis right same way if we talk about the polyethylene of the polyolefins then polyethylene it is first synthesized by the polymerization of the ethylene and also categorized into different different categories from which first category is known as l d p e second category is known as l l d p e and third category is known as v l d p e and fourth category is known as h d p e right so their full name are l d p e means low density low density polyethylene double l d p e means linear low linear low density polyethylene vldpe means very low density polyethylene and hdpe means high density high density polyethylene right so from all of them hdpe is the one which is commonly used commonly for the food packaging why because it has higher melting point and basically used in the packaging of juices milk and water right same way the low density the low density polyethylene is commonly used for the packaging of frozen food frozen foods or in the bread packaging right so polyolefins are the common one this type is the common one plastic which are being used for the packaging of food material and from the polyolefins then comes your low density and high density polyethylenes so according to their need and their flexibility durability they are